When the first F-22 took to the skies, it became evident that this aircraft represented not just an evolution, but rather a revolution. Neither America's allies nor its adversaries would possess anything comparable for many years to come. Born from the collaboration of defense industry giants Boeing and Lockheed Martin, the F-22 boasts impressive features such as supercruising at speeds exceeding Mach 1.5 without afterburners, a maximum speed of Mach 2.25, and remarkable stealth capabilities. One of its most astounding attributes is the thrust vectoring system, which significantly enhances its agility in aerial combat. After extensive debates between the USAF and the U.S. Congress, the Raptor is projected to remain in service until the next generation air dominance fighter becomes operational. Now equipped with a new upgrade package, the F-22 Raptor is poised to dominate the skies for at least another decade. After all, you can't keep a formidable bird of prey down. The upgrades for the F-22 have primarily focused on enhancing its weapon capabilities, significantly extending its target range, air-to-air -air attack capabilities, and lock-on-launch precision. The integration of these software-enabled F-22 weapon upgrades, including new versions of the AIM-9X and AIM-120D missiles, has been an ongoing process spanning several years. This integration was part of a multi-year software upgrade known as 3.2B, during which the weapon improvements were prototyped, tested, demonstrated, and validated. Furthermore, the introduction of the AIM-260 long-range radar-guided air-to-air missile will further expand the Raptor's array of Beyond Visual Range, BVR, weaponry. Among the ongoing upgrades is the incorporation of all aspect infrared search and track, IRST, capabilities. IRS is a passive method for detecting and targeting enemy aircraft, especially effective against radar-eluding stealth fighters. IRST systems detect heat signatures, enabling stealth aircraft like the Raptor to locate and lock onto enemy jets without emitting radar signals that would reveal their presence. Given the use of stealth aircraft by adversary air forces, IRST is now considered a crucial sensing capability. However, equipping the F-22 with an IRST system similar to the F-35's Electro-Optical Targeting System, EOTS, would necessitate costly and extensive modifications to the aircraft's structure. Therefore, a more practical solution seems to be the use of an external pod. Stealth fighters are typically designed to maintain a low radar profile without external munitions or fuel tanks. However, when operating over vast areas like the Pacific, additional fuel beyond internal storage becomes necessary. Currently, the Raptor can carry 600-gallon underwing fuel tanks, but these compromise its stealth capabilities. The new low-drag, low-observable F-22 fuel tanks aim to counterbalance this reduction in stealth. The F-22 low-drag tank and pylon, LDTP capability are critical to maintaining air superiority in joint operations and countering emerging threats. Categorized as a fifth-generation air superiority fighter, the F-22 Raptor represents the USAF's fourth-generation stealth aircraft technology. It stands as the inaugural operational aircraft to combine supercruise, supermaneuverability, stealth, and sensor fusion within a single weapons platform. This unique combination equips it for missions primarily centered on counter-air operations, particularly in highly contested environments. Despite its remarkable capabilities, the absence of a worthy opponent, its only official kill in two decades being a Chinese balloon, and the absence of an export version, have made this remarkable aircraft a financial burden. Being two decades old, the F-22 has faced challenges in incorporating certain technologies that have become essential for the USAF. 
However, since the decision has been made for this aircraft to remain in service until the next generation air dominance fighter becomes operational, ongoing updates and upgrades are being pursued to bridge the gap between the F-22 and the NGAD fighter.